Hey, good morning, everybody. So just a quick short here I wanted to throw out. Maybe a topic for some discussion later on. Worst roads in the country. Um, I can remember back to the 90s, some of the worst roads I ever drove on back then, probably I-94 in North Dakota, uh, I-5 up and down Cal all through California, even a good chunk of Oregon. Uh, I-5 completely, really, from about Blaine to the freaking Mexican border. Uh, overall, you know, the roads in this country, they're not horrible. But uh, after having been back out here for a little over a month now and being through Kentucky a couple, three different times, I have to say, out of the areas that I run, Kentucky, you suck. <laughs> Your roads are rating right up there in the top five worst. Um, did somebody forget to tell you that you're supposed to use the road tax money to actually fix the roads? Um, just out of, just, just wondering, you know. But anyway, hey guys, you know, uh, I just want to say thank you for uh, all the views and all the comments on the uh, 11 and 14 rule video. I am absolutely, utterly shocked and amazed at how many people have watched that video and how many have commented on it. Thank you so much. Um, had never any intention of, of maybe even one video of mine being that popular. But uh, thank you. Keep the likes coming. Keep subscribing. I'll uh, try to post some more uh, content as we get going. But, uh, yeah, throw your opinions down there. Tell me what you think the worst roads in the country are where you run. You know, I don't run all 48 states anymore. I have a pretty specific triangle I run in. And uh, Illinois, you're up there pretty high, too. Iowa, you got some crappy roads. Um, but uh, I think... And we'll talk more in length. We'll just, I'll let this go at that. And uh, we'll come back and we'll make a longer video about it later on. Anyway, guys, truck on, be safe, keep the greasy side up. We'll catch you on the flip side.